Guys, we did get out new colors and we did restock the colors that you know we have been out of for a very long time. Not to mention our panels are sewn. All of our new panels are sewn. So I wanted to come in here for one, tell you the quality and show you the craftsmanship of the sewing. I, yeah, I didn't know. Trust and believe because they wouldn't look this good if I did. So I'm going to tell you the colors that we have pretty much. Almost all of the colors we had before, but like, you know, our navy sold, sold out really fast. Our red sold out really fast. And these colors we didn't restock because it was it was summertime. But y'all was still rocking that velvet, though, baby. Y'all was still rocking it. So we just were talking about this velvet in the group the other day. So I'm going to start with this. Somebody had a picture with this. This is our um, now this is our new our new fabric. This is the part of the, the collection we already had. But this is our rose gold. Or blush, same. Um, somebody had did a design with this in the group that when we was doing the um, backdrop feedback on Monday, and it was fab. It looked beautiful. I don't, I don't, I don't even think it was ours. I don't know who fabric it was. I'm just telling you, just the color they had, and it was phenomenal. So that is, um, it should be blush on our website. This is gold, guys. The people that get it, the people that get it, get it. Some of y'all be playing around. Like this color, I'm trying to tell y'all, I don't think I'm going to be able to do it this year because it's, I've got a theme backdrop that I'm I'm already working on that has this color in it. And it's like perfect when I see and it's, it. Y'all, of course, y'all know it's um some kind of printed fabric, right, that I have that goes with this perfectly. Now, before I seen that fabric. I had a, I didn't know what to use this with y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I, I had no idea because I was under the, you know, when it was pitched to me, they kept saying yellow. And I'm like, that's not yellow. It's like a yellowish gold. It's really gold, especially when you put it next to the silver. This is the silver. Um, This is not charcoal. This is regular silver. Charcoal is a little darker, right? This is, um, this is silver. Hey, Alex. Hey, Ramona. Hey, Keisha. Hey, y'all. Y'all know I can't see that light real bright. We got a Keisha and a Ma Keisha. Okay. All right. I see y'all. I see y'all. So this is the um the silver, right? I'm going to also tell you guys some things to look for when you are comparing the quality of the velvet. Now, those of you that don't know how to drape that good, like really don't know how to manipulate it, this is going to be one key indicator if y'all have premium fabric. I'm trying to tell you, trying to tell you, trying to tell you. So this is the red. Guys, when we got this thing... <laughs> Baby, I fell in love all over again. Now, we have been out of red for quite some time. I think I sold out of red last Christmas. I don't, Y'all just came in and swooped it up. And then since the, we was focused on the spring colors, I never got more red, right? And then, you know, I shut my shop down. So I wasn't really looking at replenishing anything until I figured out what I wanted to do. But now I know what I want to do. So we went on here and replenished what we didn't have. So this red baby, we did, we did one of, what class was it? One of the classes this year, we did red, ivory. We put burgundy in there too. That velvet. Oh my God. We had red velvet, y'all. We had burgundy velvet. We had ivory. We had gold sequin. Or was it champagne? One of them colors. I don't know. But I'm trying to tell y'all, it was phenomenal. We did the three panel. We did a three panel backdrop and we added the curve support in there. Baby, that thing was hot. I'm trying to tell you. So ever since we did that um, backdrop, I knew. When I put in another order, this was going to be among the top because it was just gorgeous. And I didn't have no more. So I was kind of a little upset about that. Um, this is another one. We sold out of this really, really quick. Now, this is our navy blue. Baby, this navy blue. Oh, my God. Now, they didn't have royal blue. I was hot because we out of royal blue. But on my next order, don't worry about it. I'm going to make sure I get some. All right. Don't don't y'all don't worry about it. But baby, this navy blue. Y'all been bugging me. Y'all been bugging me. Y'all been bugging me about this navy blue. So we got it. So I do not expect it to sit on the shelves long. OK, <laughs> y'all talked about this navy blue last night on the lot. So it is in. It is in stock. It is gorgeous. Marvelous. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Trying to tell you. High quality. High quality. Now, guys, this is our eggplant. I did not order another uh, batch of this. So unfortunately, I just had to put it up here because it's so cute. It's so cute. It's, it looks like royalty, baby. It's like with my throne. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you, but this is the eggplant. And I think I only have about four left. Whatever is on the website. Cause I had to take a long time this morning to um, update it. Cause y'all was put, I said, where these orders come from? But I ain't complaining though. I am not complaining at all. Thank y'all. <laughs> so this one, I think we only have like four of them left, honestly. 
Um, we, rep we replenished our black. Of course, black has always been a staple here with us. Um, black always sell out, always sell out. Now, not only did we get black and velvet, well, I ain't gonna tell you about the other one because I ain't count them yet. I ain't put it, I ain't update my inventory. <laughs> Last time I got the black in this particular blend, soon as I went on live, it was sold out. I was like, dang, I, can I get two pieces for myself? Like, I want some. You ain't even leaving them for me. So. <laughs> I hope to get to that one tomorrow. But the black is in like this is always one of our hottest one of our hottest sellers. Um, so it's fully restocked. And then there is our burgundy. Now, burgundy, guys, I don't know. Y'all been really talking about the the like the fall colors like y'all came in heavy, especially in the group. Like every, even when I asked you guys, like, give me some combinations. Y'all came in heavy with the orange, burgundy, brown. I I'm like, hold on. Slow, slow down. <laughs> We I ain't never really request these colors like that. So it must be that's that's going to be like a hot little thing this this season. I've even seen some weddings already and some events already where they had that theme. So guys, I'm trying to tell you, I wasn't even going to get ru uh, not rust. I wasn't even going to get burnt orange. I wasn't because last time I got it and it set a little too longer than I wanted it to. But this time I think y'all got it. I think so. I might get some. I might get some. I, got, I might get some. But guys, this is the burgundy. We have a lot of this in stock. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you guys the difference right now. This is I told you this is not one that just came in. This is a, this is from a vendor I was uh, working with last year. Right now, you know, I got to play around with my vendors because I got to go with the best the people that give me the best quality, you know. So and this is a different vendor that I got this time around. So one thing I'm going to tell you guys to look for, even though this is real, this is still quality fabric. This is really good fabric. I seen some of my competitors, you know, sometimes I got to order their stuff, like see what they working with. And I was like, no, you didn't like this. How you coming? So y'all know we got, I was like, uh, -uh they ain't got nothing on us. They ain't got nothing on us, nothing on us. But this last year guys is our blend from, um, the vendor we had last year. Now I want you to look closely. Let me see if I can pull it. Now, some of you guys that is not really experienced when it comes to velvet or when it comes to certain kind of blends, you guys tend to worry about this rolling right on the edge of a velvet panel. If it's not top quality, not saying it's bad quality. I'm just saying if it ain't top quality, meaning it's somewhere in the middle. That's what it is. You're going to get rolling. That's natural. Don't sit there and try to fight yourself and try to get the rolls out because you ain't going to be able to do it because that's what the fabric naturally does. Right. That's what it do. But this rolling, if you know how to, even if you don't know how to really manipulate fabric well, because you haven't taken my class yet, then you still can kind of tuck it a little bit to kind of hide it. But there's ways that we kind of get rid of, get rid of the rolling so you don't see it. Right. However, <laughs> can we get however down in the comments? <laughs> he should say yes. That. I'm trying to tell. I said, let me shine this light on that gold because they playing with that gold. But once this gold is gone, because this gold set a little. I think I, ain't, I think I ain't give it is, is I ain't give it is just due, right? I don't think I put it on, put it on my lives and really let you guys see it because this right here, baby, this thing is banging. I'm trying to tell you, I started to make me a robe so I could just walk around the house like. <laughs> It just make you feel, give you that feel like, you know, you know, but guys, this one thing I want you guys to look for in terms of quality. This is how the edge of high quality uh, crushed vel velvet should look. It's, a, it's more or less like a pressed. The seam is kind of pressed. If there is no rolling. I don't know if you it's like pressed and it's it's thick. Like this is a little heavier than those. When I put them on a the weight, my our normal fabric, our normal velvet is about three point two pounds. This sucker is almost four pounds. Now, y'all may be like, oh, that, OK, what that mean? That means that the shipping is more expensive. And y'all know that we don't charge y'all for shipping. So <laughs> y'all may get over there and order your fabric before I change my mind. <laughs> I'm just trying to tell you, I, I could do that because I'm called the boss. So I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> but guys, I want y'all look at this scene. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Look at this scene, y'all. Top professional craftsmanship. Like all of our panels, the ones, the new ones that we just got in, all of them are sewn. They have a, your four foot, your four foot, your four inch raw pocket on the end, right? So you ain't got to worry about going find Aunt Betty to sew your panels. You ain't got to, you know, find your seamstress. You ain't got to do none of that because we didn't took care of it for you. There is no cutting fee. There is no sewing fee for the panels that we just got, right? Now, the other panels, that, like the stock that I already had, 
they're not shown. And however, you will see the price, you will see it reflected in the price. So if you see our regular panels at I think the $36.99, something like that, that's mean because they're not shown. They're, they don't have that, that sewing fee included. If y'all see these suckers, $42.99, that's because you ain't got to worry about nothing but getting them and putting them on the pole. Ha, that's all you got to worry about, baby. And it's high quality. Again, if you guys are playing, if you're, you know, you're ordering velvet, even if you have some velvet, go, go in your stock, check your stockpile. If you don't have the seam that looks like, it looks like it's pressed, right? Like with a, um, with like the chip bag thing, like a crinkler or something like that, then you probably got like mid grade, mid grade, mid grade. <laughs> hey, well, she's like, hey, auntie. I'm about to place my order on the web. So, yeah, so the website glitches are fixed, but I still have somebody still working on it. I got another um, another developer. He's working on it. What he's doing, he's optimizing it. He's making it faster. All the little stuff that, you know, the tech guys do. That, I, that ain't my job. I don't know. So he doing it like making the um, experience on the on you guys side a lot quicker, more efficient, more seamless. So but everything else is fixed, clearly, because. They was up like two and three o'clock and four o'clock in the morning placing orders. I was like, oh, I like that. I like that. I mean, precious, you got to get up and do some work. <laughs> so I'm trying to tell you, and this is in um, the, um, what I, but I, I got to do that tomorrow because I didn't do the inventory and I don't, I don't like placing calls with my inventory up to date saying, baby, we out of stock. And y'all know I say that often because y'all don't be playing with this fabric, and especially right around now. You know, a lot of you guys are building your inventory and, you know, you're trying to get the things because y'all know we sell out fast. And that that is how I'm going to roll. Like, I don't know what I was doing last year and the year before last. Like I had a whole. Maybe a whole warehouse like I, I didn't have other stuff to do, so I will not be doing that for the remainder of this year until I decide to go back into warehouse mode. But that's not where I'm at right now. So I'm going to keep my inventory controllable. So I'm trying to tell you guys, don't be sleeping on it like I ain't going to go get it. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait till she go have a sale. Baby, I ain't having no sale because I don't have enough inventory to have a sale. So I'm trying to tell you, go over there to the website. The link is in the comments. Get your fabric. Get it shipped out to you. You'll have it within three days. Now, the other blends that we restock that are sewn is the spandex. Baby, I some of the colors I forgot. I ain't even going to tell y'all. I ain't even going to tell y'all because I, I know how y'all are. Some of the colors I forgot I ordered. When I was opening up the um the bags and like put them on the shelf, I was like, oh my God, I forgot I had this. Oh my God, oh my God. So I gotta get mine first before I put the whole inventory in there. Because especially these colors, like, I ain't gonna tell y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all on, on in the group. But these colors, one project that I'm working on for the backdrop for the um level five membership. Baby, these colors are hot. Baby, these I'm looking at them. That's why I keep looking down because they so pretty. So it's the spandex. Those colors are um, we added new colors and those panels are sewn. We also have sequin. Um, those panels are sewn. Those colors will be updated. Um, and I got some interlock. So I'm, I'm I know a lot of you guys still like interlock, but I'm leaning. I'm really leaning towards spandex because that's. I'm premium, baby, and I teach premium. And, and you know, the economical blends, that's that's how you play it safe. So it's cool, but we want to roll with premium over here. If y'all trying to say y'all, you know, 2024, y'all trying to join the four-figure backdrop club, baby, up your inventory, okay? So I'm going to tell you guys about that tomorrow. Um, Hopefully I can get all that, that inventory updated tomorrow, let you guys see the colors. The, uh, I'm going to do the same exact thing so you can actually see the colors. I think that really helped you guys as opposed to looking on the website and not really being able to tell. So, again, this is our blush. I don't know. It might say rose gold, but it is one of them colors. Right. But you see the color. You see the color. Real pretty. Now, next is gold. This is gorgeous, y'all. I'm just trying to show you. Like, I can't wait to do my backdrop with this one. This is gorgeous. This is the silver. Standard silver. I just like these two together. I don't know what it is. It feel like a Coco Chanel theme or something. I don't know. I like it. This is our red. The red is gorgeous. Really, really vibrant, right? This is our navy blue. The light making it look a probably the light making it look a tad bit lighter, but it's, it's true navy blue. And um, I'll get royal. I'll get royal on the next go round. Eggplant, guys. I really only have about four of these left, so. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. If you want it, you better get it because they don't be playing. This out black. You know, black don't last long. P uh, people always snatch up our black. We had a backdrop on our, in our group on Monday. 
what did she have? I think she had black. She had black velvet. I think it was red and gold. It was just real classic. But baby, that that velvet, boo boy, the way that thing bust through that backdrop. I'm trying to tell you. And this is our burgundy. Burgundy, I don't think it's going to last long either because everyone seemed to be on that burgundy, um, ivory, orange, like the the fall colors, right? So. That is what we have in velvet. This is completely updated on the website. If you see the price, say 36 something, it means it's not sewn, right? If you see the 42, that means the every all the fees are in there. The shipping, the cutting, the sewing. You just gotta get it and design with it. <laughs> I like that. You gotta get it and design with it. Okay. All right. Now, if you guys are in the YouTube membership, you guys are gonna meet me in about an hour and 45 minutes because the night I'm going to train it on how to protect your draping business, baby. Because a lot of you guys out here, I'm trying to tell you some of y'all, y'all winging it. Y'all winging it. Now I want uh, 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 something to happen. And then now you're in a situation. So if you may not be sure how to protect your business now, this, I get it. But draping business is a little different from a regular business. We do a little more stuff that you got to be protected against. All right. So if that sounds like something you feel like you need to be trained on. Baby, go down there and join the YouTube membership. Tonight, you only have to be on level three. You don't, if you're on level four or five, then clearly you get access to everything. But this, tonight's training is for level three, which is the mentorship. And I'll see you over there. If you ain't in there yet, just join. You can always catch the replay. So when you join, you can see all of the trainings that I've done. That is all I have, guys. You got any questions? I'm excited to see you, Santa Anna, because... I think I got my little, I think I got my judge back. Like I, I, I'm back in, you see my drapes up? That mean it ain't, it ain't house time right now. It's design time, right? <laughs> Should I show this to y'all? I don't know. Cause I'm stepping on some fabric. I'm working on another backdrop for, what's this? September? It's for October. It's for October's tutorial, but it's a lot involved. It's cause I, I'm making something, right? Y'all know I always got to be a little different and make something. So that is going to be interesting. I'm trying to tell you, baby, if you're in a YouTube membership, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know where you're going, but I know where you need to be. All right. <laughs> hey, Jeff. So if you look at the place of order, the link should be below this is attached to this video. Um, it should be in the comments. If anything, it should be the very first comment and it's right on my website. If not, you could go straight to my bio. My it'll take you straight to my website. Everything is on the website. She said, show it. Yeah. No, nope, I am not. I'm not. That's exclusive for people that's a membership. Now, you know, it's my duty to teach those guys how to you know, be out and stand out from what everybody else is doing. So I'm trying to tell you, Santana, if you want a piece of this, you better get over there and join. All right. Bye, guys. I love y'all.